one part they said the Bible sees. Oh, we hear it. I can't hear you. They do. Oh, they be doing it. Oh, okay. Because they already put a lot of uh, bitches down in other locations. Yeah, they, wow. they just haven't done all of them, so some of the ones down there, they take coach. It's just different locations, they work because they're going to replace Oh, okay. Oh, I'll never time. Okay. The reason why I'm recording is because he has had them uh, move, remove benches in areas that I frequent and bus stops. No one, no one would ever believe my story. Uh, um, the Buckner route, my grandmother lived on Buckner, and it has completely changed. And they have removed a lot of the bus stops from police departments because they knew that I was going to be getting terrorized and would want to report the crimes. So they removed the bus stops from the police departments. I don't know if they just do it when, I, when I'm around or if it's just completely removed. South Central Patrol had a bus stop right in front of it, but they moved it. So did the police department on off Jim Miller. I don't remember what patrol that is, but they moved their bus stop too when I'm around. So I had this bus that I would catch, the 467. That was uh, my rescue bus, because they would uh, deliberately set up havoc around my um, bus route. So on the 467, they didn't know if I was going to church. It was multiple different churches on the route. There was a, a mall, there was a lot of shopping, and I could get everything done and like um, hide. And you know, they wouldn't know, wouldn't be able to pinpoint where I was going. Well, they changed the whole route up. The 467 used to, uh, the 466 used to change to the 467. It stopped, and then they would be able to pinpoint where I was going. I know a lot of people probably didn't believe me when I said that they removed bus stop, um, benches to areas that I frequent. No, that's the truth. <laughs>